yeah, it was a tough game, obviously disappointed. Um, we came into the game thinking we could have got a result and uh, unfortunately we could, just couldn't get it. How long have you been working on that different formation? Because it seemed to start off with three at the back there tonight and yourself being operating on the left-hand side of that defence. How long or how many trans sessions have been put into putting out that performance or that formation, I should say? Well, we didn't, get, we didn't really get the chance to um, the day before the game because obviously I probably had people watching our training session so that, that, that was the most difficult part about it and, and the quick turnaround but we have players in the team that know the, know the formation and know the position obviously to play me and Eags play um, Duff's plays so uh, we kind of know, knew the role but uh, it just never really kind of clicked for us and then we, we changed formation and, um, and we kind of got a foothold in the game a bit Was it more difficult for you to operate on that left hand side defence rather than the left wing back role that you might be used to at Sheffield United? Well, I've played both, so I understand kind of um, both positions. So um, I think it was just it was just a difficult first half for us. I don't think we passed the ball too well. Um, we were very sloppy in possession, and we just gave them a lift, you know, with our sloppiness, and, and we were on the back foot from the start. Can you put your finger on why it seems to have been so hard? I know we've been playing two away games back to back, and they're pretty difficult places to come both. But can you put your foot on why it has been so difficult to maintain position possession in both of these games? We just gotta, we just gotta be more confident on the ball, and it's, it's everyone on the ball. We need to help each other out, and it just seems to be we go a goal down, and then we start playing, and that's one thing that we need to, we need to start games like going nil down, you know. This game coming up now against Denmark is pretty much like Vladimir Pekovic described tonight as for Switzerland being a cup final. A month's time at the Aviva Stadium is absolutely a cup final from an Irish perspective. How do you view the Danish challenge? You would have had a look at what they did against Switzerland the other night. They're potentially, according to some, the second best side in the night, but we know it's probably not going to be easy again. No, it's not going to be easy, but it's a cup final, you know, and that's what we want to play. We want to play in big games and, and we have a chance to qualify with, with, a, at a, uh, with a home game in the Aviva. So we just got to look forward to it and. Um, and show up and, and hopefully we can do that and put on a performance and win the game. Does that almost bizarrely suit this side in that we know exactly what we have to do going into the final game rather than there being slightly muddy waters of three games and you're kind of like, well, if we get a point here, if we get a point here, now we know, much like if you go down a goal down and the side manage to kick in and start to play a bit of ball, we know now that we can only win or there's nothing else can happen from that game. Yeah, it was the same. It was the same mentality tonight. We knew if we won here, we qualified and and the mentality doesn't change, you know, Denmark, it's going to be a tough game, but we're at home and hopefully the fans will be that third man and drive us on and, and that's what we want. It's, it's going to be a cup final atmosphere, hopefully, and um, they'll be good, they'll be, they'll be at it, but we, we need to be confident at home, play on the front foot, put them under pressure and, and, and just get that result that we were desperate for. What did Mick say is in the dressing room after the game? Uh, he was just he was disappointed that we, we, we didn't keep possession because um, he, he sees us in training and I'm, I'm, we're playing and... He was just disappointed that we couldn't get a foothold in the game and, and that wasn't about formation or anything. That was just down to us being confident to pass the ball and it was everyone, you know, we, there was too many straight passes going out of play and, and we were just giving them the lift that we didn't want to give them and obviously we went the goal down and we, we, we went to 4-3-3 and we kind of got that foothold in the game.